The important point is that we have been able to find a consensus among the 27 member states about uh, these uh, postponements till uh, the 31st of October. But now it's up to the British government to pave the way for a compromise and for a dis decision on the withdrawal agreement. Because we have to think about the future of the UK, of course. But we have first of all to think about the future of the EU. And the EU should move on. The EU should really take decisions to be stronger. The Eurozone should take decisions to be uh, stronger. Which means that we have to uh, put this question of the Brexit behind us. And it's up to the British government now to adopt the withdrawal agreement and to find a good way out for all of us. Do you think Brexit has made the EU stronger or weaker? I hope that we will be stronger. I don't want the uh, UK to be uh, weaker. I, I just want that um, the UK will be in a situation to uh, find an agreement on the withdrawal agreement. And now it's time for the EU to be stronger. We have to face the competition with both the US and China. If we want to face that competition, if we want to be a strong economic power, we need to move on, we need to take decisions, and we don't have to spend too much time on the question of Brexit. Hi, I'm Joanna Bersacci, and thank you for watching. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more from CNBC International. Thank you for watching.